Well, I want to thank the mayor and the governor and the governor-elect. And we know the FEMA folks. We've been with FEMA a lot over the last couple of years. And Brock, I want to thank you for the job. It's been incredible. Law enforcement's been beyond anything that anybody could have believed. And uh, to see what's happened here, nobody would have ever thought this could have happened. So. Uh, the federal government is behind you. We're all behind each other. I think you can truly say, Jerry, that. And uh, Jerry and I have been speaking, and Gavin and I have now gotten to know each other, and we're all going to work together, and we'll, uh, we'll do a real job. But this is very sad to see it. As far as the lives are concerned, uh, nobody knows quite yet. We're up to a certain number, but we have a lot of people that aren't accounted for. And, uh, this is the kind of destruction. In fact, they're telling me this is even not as bad as some areas. Some areas are even beyond this. They're just charred. So uh, one thing we have, we have the greatest people in the world looking and helping the first responders. FEMA, FEMA has, you people have been incredible. Law enforcement, always. They never let us down. They never let us down. So uh, we are here. And uh, Kevin, thank you very much for the job you've done and the support you've given in Washington. And uh, Kevin, anything we can do, you know we're here. You just bring it over to the office, right? You know that. Governor, what needs to be done immediately from the federal government? What needs to be done is what is being done, and that is to put FEMA on the job, make sure our first responders are supported. We get the uh, manpower, women power that we need to get the job done. And then we got the cleanup, you got the search uh, for those who lost their lives. Uh, it's just a big, massive cleanup after a terrible tragedy. So uh, it's basically people that are right here, uh, local people, state people, that are doing the work. Federal government provides some, uh, some help and a lot of money and some expertise. And somehow uh, we'll all pull through it together. Is there, Ms. is there any way to prevent this from happening again, Mr. President? Well, we've been talking about that on the ride over, and I think we're all in the same path. We do have to do management, maintenance, and uh, we'll be working also with environmental groups. They've really, uh, I think everybody's seen the light. And uh, we, I don't think we'll have this again to this extent. We're going to have to work quickly. But a lot of people are uh, very much, uh, there's been a lot of study going on over the last little while, and I, I will. I will say, I think you're going to have, hopefully, this is going to be the last of, of these, because this was a really, really bad one. And I know uh, Gavin's committed, we're all committed, I'm committed to make sure that we get all of this uh, cleaned out and protected. You got to take care of the floors, you know, the floors of the forests, very important. You look at other countries where they do it differently, and, and it's a whole different story. I was with the president of Finland, and he said, we have uh, a much different, we're a forest nation. He called it a forest nation. And they spent a lot of time on raking and cleaning and doing things, and they don't have any problem. And when it is, it's a very small problem. So uh, I know everybody's looking at that, to that end, and uh, it's going to work out. It's going to work out well. But right now, we want to take care of the people that are so badly hurt. The families where they've lost, I mean, a lot of people have been lost. I guess, Jerry, you don't really know what the final... No, 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 no. Now, we won't know that for a while. There are areas you can't even get to them yet. But it's... Uh, we have incredible people doing the job, so we'll get that done better than anybody else could do it. And we want to thank you all for coming and being here and showing, because I think people have to see this, really, to understand it. And back in Washington, Mr. Congressman, you know that, and Kevin and everybody. We have two of our great members of Congress, and they're, uh, you're with us 100 percent. I know whatever's necessary, we're going to do, right? So I want to thank you very much. Brock, thank you very much. Thank you, sir. We're here. We're going to take in care of.